So in this video, we're gonna show you the top five handheld diagnostic scan tools for your Nissan in 2024 and 2025. We'll show you the cheapest through to the most expensive and explain what kind of features and functions each of these tools actually has. We put links to all of these kits in the description and in the pinned comment, just so it makes it a little bit easier for you to find them. You do need to be careful of fake and clone units. So by using the links, that will take you to the genuine and official products. And at the end of the video, I'll show you which of these tools I would buy for my personal Nissan with my personal money, given what I know about these tools and haven't had the opportunity to use these tools for a good amount of time. Um, at the end of the video, I'll also show you a bonus tool, which is kind of like uh, a garage top end tool that goes over and above everything on the table, but we'll come to that when we need to. And if you're still unsure about which of these tools to go for at the end of the video, then I will pop the email address in the description below. So send us an email. Um, give us your vehicle information and we can recommend something for you based on your needs and what you're looking to actually get out of the tool. Okay, so we're going to start at this end here. Now this is the version 1.0. This is called a TYT version 1.0. Um, to clear up any confusion, it used to be called an NS version 1.0, but the manufacturers of the iCarsoft, they've uh, discontinued the NS version 1.0 and put that software in one tool called the TYT version 1.0. So in this tool, you effectively get software for Nissan vehicles, Subaru vehicles, um, Toyota, Honda, Mitsubishi, Mazda, and a few more as well. Um, the full list will be in the link for this tool. But the Nissan software is definitely in this tool, and it's gonna allow you to diagnose and reset all of the main systems. So things like engines, airbags, ABS, transmission, uh, other systems depending on what's installed into the vehicle. Things like power steering, central locking, HVAC systems. It'll also do live data as well, okay? Um, this tool will also give you what's known as one service function. So all of these tools, as we go further up the list, will generally give you more service functionality depending on the tool. So with this tool, you just get one service function installed and it's that is the ability to do the oil service resets. So when you've got like the maintenance or the service message on your dashboard, um, once you've done a service, you can reset that with this particular tool, okay? So that's the version 1.0 tool. We then come to the JP version 2.0 tool. The name of this tool probably is a little bit more fitting for what it covers. Uh, it covers Japanese vehicles, okay, including your Nissan. So this will do everything that this tool will do, but this covers more service functions, okay? So yes, it'll do the oil service reset and diagnostics just like this one, but this will also do DPF regeneration, electronic park and brake calibration, electronic throttle calibration, steering angle sensor calibration, new battery registration, injector coding and ABS brake bleeding. It really does depend though on your specific vehicle. So it doesn't do all of those functions for all Nissan vehicles. So I'd highly recommend using the email address below, sending us the VIN number, if you wanted to make sure that one of those service functions does work on your specific Nissan, all right? Um, so it's really, really worth checking that before you buy, all right? But that's the Vision 2.0 tool. We then come to a whole new ball game. This is the JP version 3.0 tool. Um, this does everything over and above what these tools can do. It's a small step up in price for a big step up in diagnostics and service functionality, okay? So it does more service functions than any of these tools. So it does, yes, it does everything that these tools will do, but it will also do actuation testing, component testing. It's a bi-directional scan tool. So it does things like suspension calibration, transmission adaption, air conditioning reset, engine adaption, and other adaptions and calibrations. It has better hardware, which means it has better software or can house better software. So it has the ability to cover more vehicles and more service functions, all right? So this is a really, really uh, good tool if you're just looking for a tool for your Nissan, but you're looking for the best tool for your Nissan, all right? Um, so that's the version 3.0 tool. We then come to this one here, which is the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. This tool is a little bit different to the rest because this covers a huge range of manufacturers. So let's say you've got a Nissan, but you've also got a BMW or an Audi, a VW, a Skoda, um, 
Land Rover, Porsche, Volvo, Ford, you name it. This will cover a huge range of manufacturers. It has the service functionality or matches the service functionality of the version 2.0 tool. So it's gonna do your DPF regenerations, electronic parking brakes. Again though, it's worth checking with the email address below, give them the VIN number and they'll check to make sure it is gonna uh, be suitable for your specific Nissan. Um, and uh, and I, I'd say the same applies to all of these tools in any case for the service functions. Not so much if you're just looking for a tool to do your, de your general diagnostics, your general code reading and scan resets, okay? So just for the service functions, send the email below. Um, so that's a CR Pro Kit. And while we're sticking with the theme of multi-manufacturer tools, then we come to the best tool on the table. This is the iCarsoft CR Max. It is the most expensive tool on the table. And I've just realized the tool isn't actually right there. So give me one moment because I'm just gonna go through to the back here. I'm gonna pick up the CR Max kit, but this is probably the best bang for buck tool. I'll be back in a second. Best bang for buck tool because it has the, the best service functionality, the best manufacturer coverage, the best vehicle coverage. It matches the service functionality of the version 3.0 tool but it's all in one fast, intuitive tablet. So you can be diagnosing your vehicle through the day, you can be going online with it at night, you can put emails on here, you can put all of your apps on, you can email and print reports from it for vehicles. So if you've got a small garage or a workshop, you can print off the reports or you could just keep the reports in the service history of the vehicle to show that, look, these faults have come up and then they have been fixed as well, all right? Um, so yeah, it's the best bang for buck tool. It does all of your suspension, your calibrations. As I say, you know, it, it, it gives the best service functionality, the best manufacturer and vehicle coverage in one easy to use package. Let's say you wanted this tool for your Nissan and you also had a BMW, so you wanted this equivalent tool for your BMW. It's already gonna save you money just by buying this tool. Two of these tools will cost you more than one of these and this opens up the software to absolutely everything, all right? Um, now, free updates for life. Some other manufacturers like Autel and Xtool will charge you like 100, 150 pounds per year just for updates after you get your first years free. Well, for these tools, you get free updates for life guaranteed, all right? Which is why the iCarsoft brand is at the forefront of diagnostics at the moment, purely because, uh, you know, they're not, they're not gonna cash in on you after you've already bought the tool. I think it's, it's, it's good that they'll give you all of the free updates for life, okay? So that's just another reason why we think the iCarsoft brand is um, leading the way at the moment, all right? Um, which of these tools would I go for if it was my personal money and my personal Nissan? If I was looking for a tool just for my Nissan vehicle and I wasn't really bothered about anything else, I would definitely be the, the JP version 3.0, purely because of the, you know, the, the, the high level of coverage, the high level of calibrations, adaptions, and component testing that it can do, um, and all of the service functions as well that are really, really good for this tool. So it would definitely be this tool if I was just looking for a tool for my Nissan. If I wanted a tool for my Nissan, my BMW, Audi, and Land Rover, and or any other manufacturers, then it would definitely be the CR Max kit, okay? Um, this is just packs such a powerful punch. It's the best value, value for money, bang for buck tool out there for multiple manufacturers. This is the best tool for Nissan alone, okay? Um, so that's, you know, I have been using these tools for a, a good while now, so I, I kind of know what I'm talking about and I know all of the features and functions of all of these tools. So um, please take it from me that these two will be, the, we, we give you the best results for your Nissan, all right? Um, Anything else, I'd mentioned the CR Ultra kit. This, well, this is the high-end tool I was telling you about, the bonus tool. The reason I'm putting this in here is just because it is kind of like a really, really high-end tool. It matches that of what the dealers and the, the specialists will have. It is quite expensive though. It's about 1,500 pounds, so it is possibly aimed at those who have garages, workshops, or ultimately just want the absolute best tool money can buy, and money isn't an issue. So if you're lucky enough to fall into that bracket, then I would probably say, yeah, go for the Seo Ultra. But for most Nissan enthusiasts and owners, what we see on the table here right now is gonna be suitable for your needs, okay? If you're still not sure though about which tool to go for, please do send us an email, send us your VIN number, your vehicle information. We can look at that, get back to you as soon as we can with the correct 
tool for your needs, your circumstances. And I will put the uh, links to all of these kits in the description below this video. Thanks for watching guys, and I do hope this helps.